Hey everybody, this is Eddie Gunks here. Uh, there's been a little bit of a discussion about uh, Packard shutters and uh, attaching them to the lens board or to the camera to use with old brass lenses or barrel lenses. So this one is a 6x6 inch lens board. Okay, you can fit a 5 inch square Packard actuator. There's a hole here in the board. The hose comes out, goes through your lens board. Uh, this is your wire for your flash sink. Now, this little button here, there's supposed to be a small pin that slides in there and it goes into this housing. That's what makes it uh, go from instant and bulb. Not sure why it's not really in the right spot, but it would look like that. You pull it out for bulb and you push it in for instant. This next lens board is uh, <clears throat> probably one of the best ideas for attaching your Packard shutter. Uh, it's a box that's a couple inches uh, deep from the front to the back. You would attach the Packard shutter to the back. Uh, this allows you to have some depth. So if your lens sticks into your camera, you would still be able to uh, attach it. The drawback to this shutter box is that it sticks into the camera and then you have to somehow get your tubing and hose to come out of the of the camera. This one, this design here, they left a little bit on the top and they poked a little hole in here. You can see that. That's your hole for your tubing. Here's another hole for a flash sink. Um, this is by far the best uh, shutter mounting system uh, available in my opinion. It's made by Deardor. The thing about this shutter box is that it's a six inch square. Okay, so this attaches to the camera. And you have a lens board that attaches to the front of the shutter box. And there you have it. All the mechanisms that operate, the bulb is here, the little hole, and you can see the wire for the flash sink comes out this hole. So that allows you to use a fairly big shutter without having to poke a hole in your camera to get those hoses and, and wires out. Uh, so this shutter box would just snap onto the front of the camera, just like a regular lens board would attach. Then you would just snap on your lens, put the locking mechanism on, and you're away. Shutter box is there. It's got a little gap here. Wires come out the bottom. It, it's, it is attached to the same spot that the lens board is. So you could pop, and then you could pop the lens straight into there and then your lens is on there with no shutter box. This is Eddie Gunks saying thanks for visiting and be sure to check back for more interesting videos. Thanks and have a happy new year. See ya!